Which clip? I explain what is on and also that this is now the NFT is there. We want to include that somewhere. We need to figure it out actually. Maybe we can just use like as a meme like nouns fund ideas. That's it. Nouns fund ideas. Uh, yeah. I like that. How would they fund those? I think this video is a complete mashup. Like what is clear is that it is unclear. And there is something in this video which is the nouns thing. It was what those those two guys. So I think we want to try to make it a nice narrative video while at the same time in the spirit of hack week we also want to hack it together uh, but the agenda for today the supposed that agenda what it is supposed to be is actually to have people mint this po app so this po app uh, says prop 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 uh, prop po app and it's for nouns hack week okay. done for this venue should we give some something about nouns from a different spot oh. this spot is too much oh. So they are both from uh, Dow Lens. They work at. I, I was from Dow Lens. Yeah, you know. uh, I'm just like hustling, bro. Amazing. Yeah. Tell them what you. Think. I was in business development for Dow Lens, and earlier I was working with an NFT platform, and yeah, I'm just looking for opportunities. Live resume. Dow Lens has a product called Dow Manager, and I'm supposed to have a call with them on Tuesday, literally. Yeah. Anyway, my agenda today, bro. Because I'm giving out these poems. Are you familiar oh, with okay. nouns? Yeah. Are you familiar with nouns? Nouns. Yes, sir. What, what, what do you know about nouns? Nouns. Uh, okay, you are promoting nouns today. I, I will give it to you. Before that, you tell me like what, 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 what. So like they have a project, right? Like they kind of like mint a new NFT every day, and like they, they go for bidding like around. Uh, estimated cost is around like 30 ETH nearly. You are almost accurate. They also have a DAO, which they kind of like they do grants for. Uh, Many uh, projects uh, where if you could just like proliferate nouns, we'll get the money. And uh, yeah, that's it. That's what I know. I was thinking that's like people would not know about nouns, and he's literally given the entire uh, pitch. You give me your Twitter. Uh, I'll send you the thing right now. It's Samuel Elias. Uh, second one. Yeah, this one. Yeah, that's good. Do I follow you? Yeah, I do follow you. So I'm just gonna send it to you. So tell yeah. me, what do you know about nouns, bro? How to earn this poem? When I started off in Web3, I think Nouns was the first uh, community that I heard about. And uh, when I went to Nouns website, I was like, okay, you can generate your own NFT. It can, like, it can be a combination of different stuff. So I just created one NFT, which I was using for a long time. Right? I'll call it NFT because I just like, downloaded it. Listen to this idea, okay? Nouns are CC0, right? So you don't necessarily need to own the NFT to actually have a unique noun. You can just go to lilnoun.wtf slash playground and then generate a noun, okay? And download a unique one. And then when I meet you... Right, I'll call it NFT because I just like, downloaded it. There are a lot of sub DAOs and like uh, within the noun ecosystem like Lil Nouns. There was also one Goop uh, noun that it's called Goop. Like that's my understanding. They found a lot of different different projects, and I love how uh, like they are operating as a DAO essentially. They moved out of Discord. From what I understand, it was a very efficient way how they moved out of Discord, and they are like still operating as a very streamlined DAO, like which is truly decentralized and it is working with community itself through voting and uh, stuff. So through the proper decentralized governance. That's most what I know about DAO uh, nouns, of course. Dude, amazing! You did a really good job. You know better than me, in fact. Uh, and I'm sending you this poem, and I want you to mint it right away Absolutely. because you're, you're literally the most deserving uh, people that I know. So one of the most fascinating things about nouns is the is the fact that they literally purge their Discord. Yeah. The nouns community, the nouns DAO doesn't have a Discord, official Discord anymore. I think the idea is to decentralize it yeah. further. 
so that there is no like central entity that is that owns the Discord or something like that. If I hold a noun, if you hold a noun, nouns are CC zero. Like anybody could be benefiting of this concept, yep. and you could literally start a Discord by yourself. And like you said, there are so many like communities in the nouns ecosystem. Yeah, yeah. I like so, the T-shirt. This is my little. Keep this a bit side, please. This is your next uh, now it's turn. I don't know if the camera heard it because my voice doesn't really travel far. You can repeat that. <laughs> I can repeat. So I'm telling you, now people. So Salman is the one guy you need in India for every kind of communication that you would want. Like I cannot uh, like put it any in any other way. So thank like, you so much. I appreciate it. So actually, fun fact, fun fact. So there is a community called Headline WTF. Which is into decentralized journalism. Okay. Oh. So yeah. So they have built a nouns DAO. It is very easy to build a nouns DAO. You can literally go on Zora and hit create DAO. Okay. <laughs> on Zora, you can literally hit create and start DAO a DAO. And it and it and it opens up a DAO which is exactly like the nouns model, which is an auction at, at a certain frequency. Money going into a treasury that is decided by a drop house or something like that. And this headline .wtf is yeah. a decentralized journalism uh, community, not yet a community as okay. such. It's an end, token right now around which a community is being formed. There's no Discord or anything, but they have a prop right now for uh, funding crypto journalism. So obviously I applied. Crypto journalism. So obviously I applied. And I bought two of those NFTs in order to vote for myself. <laughs> and then what I learned is that the snapshot was taken three weeks ago. Oh. <laughs> I actually bid for 0 0.05, which was going for 0 0.01 on most other days. So I actually bid a big one, and I got two NFTs. So bro, you have a pitch for nouns now. This will be the time. Why should NounsDAO use it and how can NounsDAO leverage DAO manager? Pitch. Yep. So, from what I know about NounsDAO, there are a lot of sub communities, there are a lot of sub DAOs. And if you have visited the discourse forum of Nouns, like there are tons of proposals and very lengthy proposals, in depth proposals, which are not all that much easy to like go through in a single time. Like Now, what DAO manager does is it basically uh, can help you and manage all of your discussions, manage all of your uh, proposals, on chain proposals. We, can, we have integrated with Snapshot as well. There is also discourse integration functionality so you can bring all of your past historical proposals onto the DAO manager and then you can just continue your discussions over here with DAO manager the USP I'll tell you so there is a GPT powered uh, AI functionality which we are calling Robin which you can use to go through all of your discussion proposals you can summarize them you can create checklists out of them you can create polls out of them and you can basically also ask it to uh, critique those proposals or create a comment for that so imagine how much time your members are saving on like going through those so you're gonna have a DAO contributor friend. It's an assistant for you. An assistant in your DAO, an AI assistant yep, for your DAO. Your personal assistant, like the members' assistant. I, I, I want to check this out. Yeah, it's uh, really cool. I can, of course, like share a loom video, but I am super happy to show anyone a live demo as well, for sure. Couple of people have to second that nomination, and that enters into a poll. Oh. So good to see you. Do you know about Nouns DAO? Huh? Nouns DAO, do you know? Um, no, I don't know. Oh, yeah. For the first time I'm hearing it. Yes. These noggles represent nouns. Uh, nouns are... Nouns at the end of the day is an NFT project. It's an NFT project, specifically I'm talking about the Nouns OG Nouns project. It's an NFT project with a daily auction that funds a treasury which funds ideas that's the whole cycle people buy the people mint the nft based on an auction which collects a large fund and these people who hold these nfts decide what to do with that fund and that fund is often used for a lot of public good and to proliferate nouns and to develop the web3 ecosystem it's a phenomenal project i think this was uh, yeah we'll continue yeah yeah